What's going on, people? How you doing? TK Pryor coming at you, and just want to hit you guys with the real. <laughs> when I say the real, is just, you know, real is relative because, you know, I was having a conversation with some guys that were co-workers, and I was talking about the fact that um, I'm really working hard, uh, and I'm taking all my money and putting it to work. I actually make my money get a job, and it, it, it goes to work hard for me harder than I had to work in order to get the money and you know I was talking about taxes you know everybody pays taxes everybody looks forward to tax returns you know what I mean when it oh it's tax return season I'm gonna get my money back that I paid to the government so one of my co-workers was saying that hey I don't save money so I look at my tax return as a savings account that helps me out and I can get you know a nice chunk of change back so I was like, well, hey, man, why don't you just use the same concept but save in Bitcoin by making your money go to work in another asset? You know, instead of saving in cash, do the same tax concept where money comes out of your check every single payday and it goes into Bitcoin. And then at the end of the year, you have a Bitcoin savings account that acts just like your taxes. Everybody was like, huh? So I was like, OK. <laughs> you know, so the concept of actually making money work for you, I guess, is only limited to the rich. I mean, people don't get it. Yeah, like instead of saving in cash, save in Bitcoin or save in gold. But do the same thing that you're doing with your taxes where it comes out of your check every single month or every single payday. So at the end of the year, not only do you have your taxes, you also have your assets that you've been saving all year long. So, you know, no lights went off. <laughs> Nobody got it. Okay, so I guess the only person that I can say does that is me, right? Because that's what I do. Every payday, money comes out of my check just like taxes, except it goes into gold, silver, and Bitcoin. So at the end of the year, I'm going to have a bullion bank that I built, assets that I saved, and it's gonna be just like taxes, a little nice chunk of change that I have saved. The difference is I don't look at money the way other people look at money, so I'm not trying to spend what I worked so hard to save. Once those assets accumulate, all I wanna do is grow them further. So that's how you make your money get a job. You hear me say that all the time in my videos. I say, do what the super rich do. Implement the strategies that they implement. They don't work for money. Rich people make money work for them. Well, everybody just scratches their heads and says, yeah, what the fuck ever. Like my friend today, when I told him, I was like, yo, man, I'm working on this Bitcoin and I'm trying to make uh, as much money as I can work for me. You know, my money has a job. Every single morning before I get up and go to work, I transfer the returns that I receive and I make it compound by putting it back into the system. And I do that with two different systems in terms of compounding the uh, money I received, but I have seven different systems in total. And my coworker was like, yeah, okay, well, I hope that works out for you. <laughs> so nobody says, okay, well, let me make my money get a job also. Let me make money every single day from compounding. Let me take advantage of leveraging and actually do the same thing that super rich do. Because the two miracles of the finance world is compounding and leveraging. Those two are the most powerful strategies that you can implement. But when I talk about these concepts and how I'm doing it for myself and I explain it to other people, they just look at me and like I say, my coworker said, I hope that works out for you. And then my other uh, coworker was like, huh? Like, I don't know what the hell you're talking about, speaking English. So, perspective, <laughs> it's all about choice, and it's all about what, what you focus on. I was talking to another guy the uh, day before yesterday, and I was like, hey man, you know, I'm saving, I'm making my money get a job, and he was like, yeah, well, shit, you, you ought to have fun while you're young, because, you know, at least you can say you've been there, you traveled, you did this, you did that, I said, well, how about sacrifice while you're young so that when you get old, you can do any damn thing you want? So it's all about perspective. It's all about mindset. It's about the way you think and how you implement different strategies in your life. 
the only suggestions I make in these videos is that you do some of the things that rich people do, you know, because poor people typically don't think that way. And a lot of people out uh, do things that are counterproductive to financial success. So what I talk about is uh, adopting the ways of the rich. Normally what happens as you make money in life, you become rich and then you start learning the tactics that I'm telling you about. You start learning the ways that rich people just do things. Like, hey man, that's not how we operate. You know what I'm saying? When you make $100,000 a year, this is just what we do. You know, and usually that's how it happens because people don't typically share information. So hopefully somebody out there is blessed by this information. I do use it for myself. I am working towards building my personal sovereign bank. I am the uh, bank of me. Infinity banking is in full effect. And, you know, that's just a strategy to survive in the 21st century. You want to make it, you got to get on infinity banking. You got to use the concept of infinity banking to build your own personal sovereign assets so that you dictate uh, your future success. You operate your personal household like it's a corporation and you structure yourself within a, uh, 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 a company systems and, and that's it. You know, that's how you make it, guys. But if you'd like to work with me, um, please email me, PM me on Facebook, uh, get in contact with me. My Facebook page is under my name. My YouTube channel is uh, Master Wealth Builders. And um, there you go. So hopefully, like I say, somebody out there is blessed. You know, I noticed that everybody is starting to copy everything I do. You know, when you see my Facebook post, I generate it with my own creativity and thought. When I see my same uh, Facebook post on somebody else's page, <laughs> even even my tagline, Master Wealth Builders, is starting to be copied by other people. It's amazing. So people listen to what I say, but they don't want to work with me. It's amazing. Hopefully you'll work with yourself and begin to uh, build your own bank.